Alright people, Mike Boss here again today and I'm um, playing another MDS5 Ground Zeroes mission it's the classified intel acquisition uh, side up. I'm going to be trying to get an S rank as usual uh, so let's get uh, straight into it here Classified Intel Acquisition uh, This is probably the easiest mission to S rank in my opinion uh, you're not really under any pressure at all, uh, and it's fairly simple. And first of all, you don't even have to get out of the back of this truck, you just stay in it the entire mission, mainly. It gets you into the base, and it can get you back out again. But I went for a different route on the way out. Uh, you don't have to follow that route that I'm going to be taking. Uh, but I felt like doing it, because I had the time. And I was pretty certain I was going to get the S rank anyway. Now when you're in the back of this truck, try not to be standing up like that. And you know, moving about too much because some of the guards, they are out there and they will see you and come and investigate. So just try to stay down and uh, yeah, just be patient here in the beginning. Now you can crouch and see around you uh, to get like a bit of your surroundings and sort of figure out where some of the guards are and things like that uh, but as I say don't be jumping up and down and shooting at people and doing anything like that because you're going to get caught pretty easily <laughs> obviously uh, there's a guy in that tower there so I'm just getting prone again uh, I'm just taking the flashlight off that gun because uh, if I have to get it out, I don't want to be shining it and alerting the guards. Now basically what we're doing here is we're riding this truck into the admin building. Uh, where there is a tape which contains intel that we need. Uh, it's a false tape, the real one's being carried by a guard. The fake tape is up in that tower. Uh, uh, so I'm gonna just uh, head up there and get it first. So it's best to come around this way because there's really no guards behind here and it's just a pretty good shortcut. And then hopefully you can get down here. Now there's two guards down here to your right so you're gonna want to go prone and try to headshot both of them. Now where, uh, there is. Now you just try to get a good headshot on him here. You there we go. And we'll just take out his friend here. You know you want to definitely put both of them down so they don't see you when you're uh, climbing up this ladder here. Now it's very easy to get spotted from the uh, to your right hand side. There's guards walking around down there, so you want to crouch walk along here because it can be really annoying to get seen and then have to restart and wait for that truck to bring you back here again. Now you're going to want to do this fairly quickly. Just shoot out this camera, run in, get the tape and get down and climb over this railing and just simply get ready to take out this guard uh, just try to get him right in the head. And now that camera would see his body, so we're going to take out it out as well. And now they're going to be coming to investigate, so you want to do this fairly quickly. The bald guard with the real tape is down here. Uh, we're one just going to. Get a headshot on him if you can. Try not to miss like that. Now you don't have to headshot him, you can't sneak up behind him, but I felt more secure doing it this way. So when he's over here, just uh, kick him to uh, wake him up. Oop, right, there we go. Now, and then just hold him up. And once you have him, just grab him and interrogate him. And he should give you the real tape. And there he's dropped it there. Now we'll just knock him out. And we'll grab the tape. 
And I'm gonna extract him as well. Because he's actually a unique character. And apparently if you extract a lot of people in Ground Zeroes, they will show up in the Phantom Pain, uh, which is the full Metal Gear Solid 5. They'll show up on your mother base. Uh, so that's why I'm extracting him. Now, I'm, uh, most people maybe just left him there or only got the tape. But I noticed that if you extract him, it comes up on the side of the screen, Extracted Bald Soldier. Now, it doesn't say that for many of the characters. And it's in yellow writing, and that usually means they're a unique character, so... It's probably good to just take him out. Uh, now, try to headshot this guard through the door. Now, as I say, this isn't the main way to do this. What you'd normally do is just get the tapes and then hop in the back of the truck again. Um, wait for uh, the guards to uh, drive you out of the base. But I uh, wanted to extract this guy as well. Now, I'm just trying to take out the guy in the tower. This is a really slow way of leaving the base. Uh, but, yeah, I felt it was worth it. Now, you obviously don't have to do this in your run. And you could probably find a far quicker way of getting out, but this is just how I like to do, do it. Now you're just going to watch that surveillance camera and s just hug this wall here. Stay to the left of this wall and you're almost home free once you sort of get down around this area. Because the guards, they don't really notice you so you can speed up a bit here. And uh, now I obviously wanted to check if I was going the right way. So I'll move back there to get a vantage point. And then I realised uh, that I was going to run past the place. So I came back. And what I'm doing here is I'm just going to carry him out of the base. Not going to bother calling in Morpho or anything like that. Now careful because there can sometimes be a guard walking around over here. That's why I'm being cautious. I don't see him, so then I'll just break in there run. And that's basically the mission over. And as you can see, it says extracted bald soldier there. Now, I'd say he's going to show up again in the Phantom Pain. I don't think that could have gone any better. And... You're the man in charge. Yep, there's the S rank. Again, not the fastest run or the quickest, uh, efficient way to do it, but yeah, you get the S rank. And anyway, that was just uh, Mac Boss uh, doing another Ground Zeroes walkthrough. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe. And I'll see you here again. Mac Boss signing out.